Fire signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. And this reading, for those of you in a third-party love triangle situation, we're going to find out what's the most likely outcome of this situation. And for those of you who like to book a personal reading with me, information is in the description box below. Today is the 28th of January, 2023. Time is 11.50 a.m. here in Bali, Indonesia. This is a collective reading for fire signs and if you were to finally get it to watch this video, this message is meant for you even if you're dealing with the same fire sign. Alright, now let's get your reading started. Alright, I've got a little bit of a sore throat so please bear with me. Spirits and angels, please show me for fire signs, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius in a third party or love triangle situation. What is, what is the most likely outcome of this situation? Three pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So number three indicates, could indicate the party situation. And also we've got the two of swords here, a choice between two person. But what I'm sensing here is eight of cups. Someone is going to decide. When I say someone, that means it could be you, your person, or the third party, okay? Someone is going to decide, okay, I'm just going to leave. And then mm. five of wands, someone is going to fight and argue and offer some sort of a commitment, but it's small. Page of Pentacles. Hmm. And then Knight of Pentacles and Reverse, Two of Swords. Also, Two of Pentacles here indicates a choice. So, or number five, Five of Wands can indicate someone feeling really conflicted. Just giving you an example, if your person puts you in a third party situation, I feel like your person is going to feel really conflicted. Your person will have to actually make a choice between you and somebody here who to offer this commitment. And then Knight of Pentacles and Love First, that means a delayed commitment being offered to someone because there's indecision, right? Two of Swords and Two of Pentacles here. And Knight of Swords here is in Love First. I feel like an offer will be made eventually. Maybe your person is going to offer you a commitment and you may not be 100% sure if you want it. I think you're going to weigh the pros and the cons. I don't see you actually rushing into making this decision. I feel like you're going to make this person wait. Your person who puts you in a third party situation. Unless roles are being reversed here. Unless they are making you wait if you offer it to them, okay? Hmm. There's a stuck energy in the world in reverse. I want to walk away, but then I can't. The world of fortune in reverse. Again, a stuck energy. A lot of indecision. I feel a lot of drama. Five of Wands. Hmm. I feel like the most likely outcome is 50 50. It's all, I can't even say that. I, one thing for sure that I can see here with the Page of Pentacles is one person is going to offer a commitment. Somebody's going to offer a commitment. But then it depends on that person if he or she wants to accept it or not. Okay. Or the Page of Pentacles could be like, should, who should I offer to? This one or this one? So definitely indecision, a lot of conflict here with the five of wands. Okay. A lot of stress, man of swords. There will be a lot of communication with eight of wands here. There will be a lot of communication back and forth, three of pentacles, four of swords. I think there will be an attempt to save the... An attempt to save the original connection. There will be an attempt to save the original connection. But the four swords in reverse and the four wands here in an upright position. 
it feels like it's going to be delayed. Because Ten of Cups here is in one verse and Nine of Swords, again, a lot of stress and the strength here indicates somebody needs to be very patient. It feels like a slow energy. There will be an attempt to restore the original connection. The original connection is the original partner, right? Until the third party, the, the third person came into the picture. So the original one, just let me know in the comment box below if it resonates where you're at. Are you the third party or are you the original partner, okay? Are you in the original connection or are you the third party? Just let me know in the comment box below if you want to. Just want to see. Um, I just want to see if... I mean, it helps for me to kind of read better in the future because it kind of... It makes me feel like... See how accurate I am as well. Fire signs, okay. Ten of Cups here in my verse. I feel like this this is supposed to be the original partner because the Three of Pentacles here, the church, is already almost done, but it's not completely done yet. So there is a foundation there with the four one. So this led me to believe that someone is gonna attempt to save the original connection, okay? There'll be a lot of talking, but then eight of cups. There will be someone saying that they're gonna leave, but then someone is gonna try to stop that one person here, okay? Feel like it's the original partner. And with the Nada Pentacles here in one verse, still fighting over this infidelity here. The person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, or a Taurus, who knows, it could go vice versa. It feels like it's gonna come up again. So there'll be an attempt to again save the connection, but then but then there will be an argument being brought up in regards of the infidelity. Like it's never ending. Like it's gonna be brought up over and over again. Like nobody's gonna actually, that victim is not gonna put, put it behind him or her. There'll be, they will try eight of ones. It could be you or this person, okay? But, but then there'll be another fight and argument here in regards to infidelity with the Nine of Pentacles in my verse. And there'll be Ten of Cups here in my verse. Trouble in Paradise. Four Swords in my verse. Somebody's gonna feel really restless. The World in my verse. And then we've got Page Pentacles and then Two Swords. So what I'm seeing here, Fire Signs, is really super complicated. So the original partner, one of, one of them is gonna say, you know, I'm gonna walk away from this. Then they're gonna fight. Um, they're gonna try and figure it out. Try. They're gonna try to fix things, but then, then some things will come up again from the past. I feel like they're gonna have a fight. You or this person, or that your person, or with the the other the third party. Okay. And then the ten of cups here. There'll be trouble in paradise. And then suddenly there's this offer here, that's gonna be made. feel like an offer is going to be made to two people okay it's really complicated it feels like an offer will be made to two people and whoever who takes it will be together do you know what i'm trying to say fire signs it's like okay if i am if i'm the one who is putting two person if i'm the one who has two options here okay I'm going to offer to both of them commitment because both of them may not be 100%. Um, how do you say? Because two person, both of them are not even 100% sure if they want to stay in this connection. So whoever takes that offer is the one that this person that I'm going to be end up being with. I hope this makes sense to you, Fire Science. I know it sounds really complicated. It could be you offering to two people or your person offering to both of you. Because the only reason why I'm reading it that way because there are two two here. Two swords and then two pentacles. So two person will be considering whether to accept this offer or not. The page of pentacles. 
And the Knight of Swords in reverse indicates maybe this person is not being completely truthful about it. Okay? So complicated about Eight of Wands, a lot of shifts, a lot of changes, a lot of communication back and forth. There'll be an attempt of reconciliation for once with the original partner. And then there'll be another fight and someone lying and someone offering commitment to both. Whoever who takes it first is the one that they're going to end up being with or that's the one that you're going to end up being with. Oh, <laughs> this reading is so complicated. Let me know. I'm, I'm really curious. I want to find out if this resonates. If this resonates with you or not, any kinds of details, you can just let me know. I'd like to know. I'm actually curious. All right, take care. Fire signs. Um, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. If you resonate in some way, shape, or form, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. And subscribe. And if you'd like to watch more of these videos that I've already posted, but with different topics, different questions, you can click on the daily readings playlist or you can click on videos. I believe you can see it on the screen right now. And also, I'm open for personal readings. If you like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Um, yeah, I've added a few options. One of them is the emergency reading, which is what everybody has been booking me for. That's why I've been doing a lot of readings and I'm so tired. But anyway, yeah, just send me an email and I'll reply you with all the information, all the necessary information. Also, if you want to binge watch with all the videos I've already posted, which I post a lot every single day, a couple of times a day, and they are being uploaded um, right away. So they're still fresh and new. Check those out as well. Okay, fire signs, take care. Take care. Hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow. Bye.